What's going on, people? What's going on? I was up in, uh, I'm up by Morris County, New Jersey, Livingston, New Jersey, which is Estes County, and we're going to go past Richie the Pool Biardo's house. Um, this is all mountains, hills, kind of country. It's hard to get a good look at his house, but we're going to try. We're going to give it a shot. Let's see if we can, uh, let's see if we can get a look at Richie the Boots' house. So this is the area that it's in. Livingston, New Jersey. He's from Newark. Born in Naples. I think Naples, Italy. So we're going to try and get a view of Richie the Boots' house. It's going to be difficult, but let's see if we can do it. It's going to be hard. I'll try and give you a view real quick. It's right here on the left, you see? So take a look. This is Richie the Boot Biardo's house on the left. I'm going to turn around and you'll be able to see it, all right? So he moved up here to the suburbs and built an estate up here so you can see the lions. You see everything there? Biardo, see? Richie Biardo. You could see it right there, Biardo. And that's him. I'm gonna try and give you a view up the driveway. This is private property, but that's what it looks like. Look at the gates going up. Is that crazy or what? All right, so that's where we're at. That's the Biardo house in Livingston, New Jersey. It's uh, guarded, gated, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to try to find a back view to it. But just take a glance at this. You can see his name, Richie, Richie Biardo. And that's him in there. And that's, you know, he's got the lions outside. I forget what that signifies. It means something. Let's see if I can get a back view. So we're up in the hills. We made a right past his house. Now, this, if I remember correctly, takes you to the back entrance of the house. But you may not be able to see it. But this is what it looks like up here in the suburbs of Essex County. Right here is the back entrance. There it is right there. But you really can't go in. It's gated. Um, that's it. That's the, that's the Biardo Estate down there. Um, this is kind of private property. I just wanted to get you a glance of what it looks like back here from back here. That's the edge of his pool. I don't know if you see that down there, but that's this is the entrance to his property. And that's the edge of his pool. Big fountain. So like I said, this is the back. There were two ways to get into the property. We'll pass the front again and then that, that should be it. So, I may be wrong, but if I'm not mistaken, you can get a glimpse from this section of the... Yep, this is it, too. Alright, you're not going to be able to see anything, but... Yep, yep, up there's another gate to his house. That's all his property. Look up there, you see? Oh, yeah, yeah, there it is. There's the house up there. Up there on the hill. That's where a crematorium... They said the crematorium was in the back here. That's the house... There's more gates, and up there, they said he said he had like a crematorium in the back. But that is the actual house. That's Richie de Bupiardo's house. Let me turn back a little bit. And that's it, up on the hill. So from all, it's so big, it takes up so much property that from all different angles, you can see it. All different streets within the town of Livingston. I'm going to go back out to the front. So one of the reasons he decided on Livingston is it's at the end of Estes County, but it has a close proximity to Belleville and Newark areas where he predominantly operated, you know. That's where he was from, so that's where his crew was. It's hard to see, like I said, you can't, can't really get much, but we'll get close like this, and you get to see that's, that's the entrance. Again, I'll go one more time into the... Uh, into the driveway and you'll get a glimpse into it and then that'll be it see if we can zoom up let's see if we could zoom see what it looks like when you go in 
And that's it. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed that. Just a quick glimpse into the Richie the Boot Biardo's uh, residence in Livingston. This was the Godfather. The Godfather of Jersey, Genovese Captain. So I'm going to take you up the street and show you how how long this property is. We're going up a street here in Livingston. So it its backyard, its property is all the way up. It follows all of this. It stops right about here. It's right there up on the hill. The house. All right, so it's uh it travels. That property travels. So we we started from the main road, Buford Road, and we're still going. And this is, all these houses is still his property on the other side. That's how long the property is. Now it narrows out over here. And then we're going to go in the back way like I showed you. Let's I'll show you real quick that, that quick glimpse into the back way. So that's how wide this property is. We're up in the hills here in Livingston, New Jersey. Beautiful area. Really, literally 15 minutes from from Newark, and then right here. And I believe these these houses here are part of the property. This one, I think his grand, his grandson lived in number four. I'm not sure, but yep, this is all part of him on the right. And then it ends here. Can you imagine? That's how much property he had. That's how far it goes. Really, really deep. We can't go in. I would love to go in, but we'd be trespassing, and I don't want to do that. All right, so we're doing one more drive-by. Basically, right there is the, if you can see on the left. And that's it. We're going to call it a day. Just want you to get a glimpse at, glimpse at it. Glance at the Biardo Estate in Livingston, New Jersey. Again, he chose this because it's so close to 280. He jumps on 280. He's in Newark. This is years ago. He would be in Newark in about 15 minutes. Belleville, Newark, Bloomfield area in about 15 minutes. Oh, sorry. We're basically in the woods in the back of Richie's house. And that's the entrance right there. So... Let's see if we can take a walk up here. We're probably on private property and don't belong back here. But let's uh, let's see if we can get a glimpse. I mean, I'm not doing anything wrong, but we probably don't belong here. We're on the outskirts. We're not in his property, right? So, oh wow, look at what we got here. The entrance to the estate. That's the driveway that we were just, uh, that we looked up on. Now, when, back in the day, he had dogs out here. And, you know, he had wild dogs on the property that would protect everything. I've never been up here. Look where I'm at. I'm basically in the woods here. In Upper Essex County, New Jersey, Livingston. Oh, this is the actual incinerator, I guess, that they they said they got rid of bodies in here. Wow. I was never up here. That's the house. That's the Biardo house. Wow. Oh, my God. I can't believe I'm actually up here. And that's him on his horse. That's Richie the Boot on his horse. He had that made. Look where I'm at, guys. This is crazy. You pull up the driveway, and this is what you see. This is crazy. I can't believe I'm up here. That's about all I could see right now, so we'll call it a day from that. Get up any higher. This is where we're at. 
probably on somebody's property and I don't want to do that. Wow. Fountain. House. I think that's the pool house over there. See, they got cameras and everything, so I really don't belong here, but that's, that's the Biardo house. All right, and now we're gonna head out. Just get one more shot at the driveway and that Richie to boot on his horse. Look up Richie to boot Biardo and you'll understand who he was and what he was all about. That's it, guys. We're getting out of here, okay? Later.